All right, here to go. Bad thing is this road has rock on it right here. It's just that wet. And uh, today's Thursday. They're talking about us getting more rain Saturday and Sunday on this. That's gonna make it even a little bit more interesting there. I love that. Yeah, try to slide. trying to get Danny turned around now the one of the big problems with where we live here the ground is really really wet right now so it got down to 24 last night hard freeze on the ground here but I mean it don't go it don't go very deep just just on top and I mean it's thawing it's uh eight Eight fifty right now, and it is thawing like crazy, and uh, that makes things really, really difficult for us right there, boy. When it when it thaws, rarely, we, we never have a you day. Never have a day where it stays frozen okay, all day long. Way, it's just a constant. Freeze and thaw, freeze and thaw, freeze and thaw. It's just back and forth, and then it rains, and then that freezes and it thaws, and it just it uh, makes it tough. See, Chad's got Danny's trailer pick slap up off the ground with him walking him around right there where he can get turned around. I got Scott fixing to come by me right here on my right right here to get up there too to where we can get him turned around. It uh, let's see, Scott's finna come by. You just gotta do what you gotta do to try to get loads out. There's All them trailers need them on there. We couldn't have uh there Scott. So I'll load them, get them get them back right back rolling again. You see Danny sliding right there. Y'all get ready. So he's gonna slide 
into that ditch right there when he gets up here. We're gonna pull that disc off that cutter tomorrow, fix it. had to pull his cable out to get a knot out of it. You had to do that every now and then. It'll get hung as he's winching it back up, winching back up to the truck now. All right, here they go. Getting far enough over that time, that trailer didn't go off the road there. You can see where the other ones that went in the ditch there. <laughs> we got that road completely in the wide open suns on it all day. Still that wet. So Derek cut right through lunch just then. That's what it looks like. Now, well we gotta take that disc off that saw head tomorrow. The, uh, the fluting that's around the inside of that bottom of that saw head where the disc spins, it is already wore through on that thing. And a year and three months. Well, saw chips and wood is rough on this stuff. And uh, a little disappointed in that. It shouldn't have wore through quite that quick. But it's actually got a hole on this side of that, uh, of the, it's right on the inside of where the disc rotates around and around. We call it fluting in there. And they make the pieces that go back in it and you just, you have to drop the disc on it and weld it in there. The worst part is taking the skids off the bottom of the head and dropping the disc down. Just dropping the disc ain't too bad. We've had to do it a bunch of times on several of our saw heads get stuff hung in them or replace a disc or something happened. Knowing it. It sure do.
quitting time. So believe it or not, as wet as it was and as much trouble as we had all day today getting trucks out, we had to pull every truck out of here, hook to them with the 635. We're having some issues with our 630. We got something on it that's uh, causing it to derate. When it derate, it basically loses all power and all that good stuff like that. Those of y'all in the know know what I'm talking about. And so you can't depend on it right now. They're coming tomorrow. We're gonna do a bunch of. We're gonna do some stuff to it and try to figure out what's causing it to derate, so that we can get it fixed. But I will say this: Remember, we put a brand new winch. Tiger Cat sent us a brand new winch to go on that 6:30 back toward the later latter part of the summer. <clears throat> that thing will forever more pull. Remember, we took the winch off the 6:35 and went through it and rebuilt it. Uh, that thing will pull so at least our winches are working the way that they're supposed to and we actually had a truck today get in that ditch right there about lunchtime and chad was able to winch him out of that ditch there so that was that was good so winches good uh some of this stuff with the derating and fault codes and stuff popping up back like what we used to deal with all the time with the john deere stuff man and, and why we went to tiger cat was because of that but uh so now i guess tiger cat's gonna follow suit with john deere they couldn't stand it because john deere had all the good fault codes coming up so now tiger cat's gonna they want fault codes too count how many poles i got here let's see three Mm -hmm. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Six. That's sixteen, something like that, I guess. I still don't have enough for a load. I got six laying up there right now. So I'm gonna go home, get the dogs out. Got to get ready for the big giveaway tonight. Which, when y'all watch this, it will already be done, happen, and be over with. And the package will be on its way. I'm gonna draw tonight. Late tonight. Two drawings. One big drawing, and then I'll show you here in a minute. And then the other one, and then when Jill leaves in the morning, those packages are going with her, and they're going out tomorrow, which will be today, which will be Friday. <laughs> They'll be going out, trust me, on, on this right here. So let's go on. <laughs> <laughs> so we got my mini me in here right now. This is in a key. This is my oldest one here. She got home a little bit late tonight to work a basketball game. So what we've done is is we have we're doing this old school here. So every order that's made has a four digit order number with it. So what Jill and I did is is I had Jill to write down it's 143 separate orders in this thing. So I'll just show you right here for proof everything let's see here I get to focus right there so that's 1438 right there all right so let's see here's another one right here oh well, there's two right there stuck together all right so that's 15 1505 they're just we've got them all folded that's 1440 right there so what we're going to do is, is I'm going to have Anna Kate draw every one of them. There's no bogus stuff going on here or anything like that. So I've got my laptop open over here and you can see the order numbers right there beside it. So she is about to draw. I'm going to mix them up real good. I want you to just draw one, okay? okay. And the one is going to be the grand prize winner. So you are the man with the plan the whole sure. wh whoever's yeah whoever the winner is so just get one just draw one okay all right, all right so here we go don't look now there we go all right she's mixing it up okay. hang on hang on hang on what, what, before you do it roll your sleeve up so nobody be thinking no fun to, no roll it up somebody be thinking you done slip oh. something out of your sleeve and everything Cause I didn't want to do this computer generated or nothing like that where a computer fix it or anything. So you can see her hand right there. I had a good one too. Did you? Well, I didn't want because the sleeve look didn't look right right there. Okay. All right. So what we got? All right. What number is that right there? 
1432 right there all right hang on. let it focus oh you can see it good enough right there all right let's hold it right here let me uh go we're going to back up a little bit here 1432 let's see uh Just a second here. This is not going, still not going to get it right there. We're getting closer to go. I forget how many is on the page. That's still not going to get it. Let's see, number 1432 is. We're getting closer. It'll be the next one, yep. Yeah. Next one. Okay. <laughs> Demetrius Robinson is who is who it is. Four, fourteen thirty-two. So you see that right there? Very cool. So that's Demetrius Robinson. Won the big he got the big prize pack right there. Is what he got right there. Okay. All right. Now so Anna Kate, so we got fourteen thirty-two on that one. So we're gonna draw one more and we'll put together another prize pack, okay? Aww. So you're gonna draw one more. All right, so dig out one more there, buddy. All right, what number we got right there? 1361. 1361. Okay. So that's going to be back. way on back right here. Let's see here. Let's go on back another one here. Still going to be one more, I think, right there because that's 1397. Whoop, went too far. Let's see here. So it was on this page then. All right, Gregory. See, there's 1361. And right there is 1361. Gregory Bobo is who got that one right there. Okay. So those are the two winners right there. Gregory, I'll put you a prize pack together. It'll go out. So uh, I'll uh, get both of these. I've got all these packages over here. This is going to be going out uh, in the morning, plus these next two are going to be going out too. So uh appreciate everybody who who played along, who did this right here. There's 100 and 143 separate orders in there. I think I said that a while ago. And uh, me and Jill have covered some ground, man. I'm telling you, we have. Anna Kate helped out on taking packages, shipping them for me, and everything like that. So, uh Good deal. Uh, I'm going to try to keep the giveaway stuff going. So uh, appreciate every, each and every one of y'all who played. We'll catch y'all later. Later, taters.